Hi guys, so something crazy just happened. Um, yesterday, I think Tekken 7 released a new character, a woman character, and she uses a lot of Shotokan, Gojiru, and Shitoryu movements, like Heian Sanda movements, and uh, Lanjuke, and all that. So I recreated her gameplay, so check that out. So let's watch the first scene. The opponent does an oizuki. She follows it with the gyakuzuki. Usual gyakuzuki to your stomach doesn't, you don't do it as low as her. However, if you're aiming for the speed, you commonly see it like that. But if you're aiming for the power, you don't go that deep. And then goes a, for a manjiuke. This is a block. And then she does a strike with the shuto, which is the knife hand with a zeng tsudachi, uh, front, front stance. The opponent does a kick, block, and then boom, turn, elbow, strike, and then punch. That's an actual movement from a kata called Heian Sandan, where you block the opponent's attack with your elbow, using that spinning momentum for the other elbow to come around from this end. And it's a very um, useful technique you use to evade. So that's a very accurate um, recreation in the kata of Tekken. The next scene, the opponent does a strike, strike, you block, block, and then boom, boom, <laughs> nidangeri there. This was so hard. I couldn't do a maigeri and then a uramashi, a hook kick. And it's, I think it's impossible. Any, nobody can do this. So I, um, uh, I did it as a keage, side snap kick. And then she does like a, um, like a goju shi hodai kind of preparation movement. And then does a block, punch up. That's actually from a kata called heian godan. And you see that in the actual kata. Punch, spin kick, 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 and then boom. That's an actual um, attack from um, a lot of other st um, styles as well. You, you're punching the opponent's um, mizochi, which is the solar flexus, and the jinchu, which is the part right here underneath the nose with those two attacks. Very nice. But then how she pulls back the, uh, <laughs> uh, the attack, how she ends it is like a kyokushin karate. So a lot of different styles mixed up. <laughs> Punch, punch, block, and then she does a agiuke using her wrist to block up the punch. Very accurate. And then she does a oizuki three times in a row. <laughs> to be honest, some of these moves I haven't practiced before, so I'm pretty sure I'm lacking the technique. If you know the technique correctly, please um, write that in the comment section below and also score me at 100 how well I did. Next attack, she does a gyakuzuki. Usually the gyakuzuki, we don't load and punch. So that's more of like a boxing kind of way, but still, you know, it's not so bad, I guess. And then she flicks the leg when the opponent goes for a roundhouse kick. This kind of movement you see in a lot of martial arts. Like I've seen one in, in uh, a Kung Fu as well. So I think it's very common to see this and then goes for a punch to the floor. It's very actually hard. <laughs> to punch somebody you know, from the standing position to go down, get, get the weight on the fist, and punch down is actually pretty hard to do that. And then the next one, pun does a mashigiri, sway to the side. That was a little bit like boxing, but still very good technique. And then goes for a keage, side snap kick. And then oizuki, very karate-like. Goes for a yakuzuki again, a little bit too low, but still it's good. And then she does a side thrust kick, that's called a kekomi in Japanese. You thrust, you push the kick, and then one, two, three, wow. A double kick and then a back fist strike to the floor or to the bottom. Um, this is an actual movement from a kata called kankudai, and it's very accurate. We practiced like that. <laughs> And 
then a last one, um, I also noticed that Stoke, the one she's doing, her um, hand is like this. The correct way is this, so a little bit of a mistake there. I hope they fix it by the time they release the character. She does a block first and then a kekomi, again side thrust kick to the bottom. Does a mawashigeri back roundhouse kick, gyakuzuki. One, two, three, wow. Those three movements are actually from a kata called kururunfa from Gojuryu. Very accurate. I couldn't do it so well, I, I, think, I think. And then she does the uh, punch again, elbow strike, and then a mawashigiri. That elbow strike kind of looks like a one from Gensei Ryu. And in Shotokan, we don't have um, uh, elbow strike where we lift up the back leg. However, uh, like I mentioned, a lot of the techniques were accurate. So I'm very happy that I was able to recreate this. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any other video games or movies that you'd like me to cover, please comment that down below. I'm pretty excited to um, recreate new moves. So if you like the video, like it, subscribe to my channel from here. And I do my online group lessons and private lessons. So check that out from here and more videos coming out right here. I'll see you guys next time.